That will be Those nice. online, can I hear you? Okay. Hello, can you hear me? Those online? Are you here? Or there? Yes. Very well. Hey, you can hear me, yes. Nabi? Can you hear me? I said the past person for today is 20... Yeah. 20 That. Let's go. Oh. But I will know we are finished. Uh, all this uh, after project and look at that one. So, uh, we are looking at them. Uh, Capital, what they and the before can go back to your notes. For this one, we are calculating. Grammar is now a problem now. Uh, final two. 2019. Please, somebody help us post it now. 2019, 2020. Last question. Uh, question 2B. 2B. That be Those asked. online, can I hear you? Active. Hello, can you hear me? Those online? Are you here? Or there? Yes. Very well. Hey, you can hear me, yes. Nabi? Can you hear me? I hear you. I said the past person yes. for today is 2019-2020 section. Number 2B. Question 2B to be sent to the group very soon. That is just to conclude the capital budget generally. Capital budget is divided into two, certainty and what? Or certainty. Is it set? Somebody has got this. Okay, yes, yeah, not a good one. So, so that we know that this issue of capital budget, we have tried. You can practice more on your own. Abi, capital budget is not the only person that will come out. So we have seen mathematics of finance. At least you have hope in that one. Sometimes they even set two questions on that one in note to handle it. Capital budget, you may see two questions. That one is very short. Sure. Uh, there's no way they will avoid capital budget. It's not possible. Something must come, either one or two. And uh, the other ones, like leverage, capital structure. Um, so the cost of capital, you know, that was so good. We'll look at that some other thing. Let's just handle this one. Is that my office? Yes, I will do this. That's the one I will say. Okay, like I was saying. Good morning, everyone, or afternoon. And why those of us online, so welcome to the segment. Uh, we'll quickly go through this one is purely calculation. If you look at it very well, it's loaded. Have it the one, the two, the three. But what you are seeing there is not difficult, don't let your heart be troubled. Trust in the Almighty, there is hope always. Let's move on. If you look at that question, the question says, Color only limited is considering an investment project. Costing 14,000. That means the cost of capital, Abbey, uh, the cost of the project is um, 14,000 naira. That is settled. That is year zero, Abbey. What you are seeing there, all year one, year two, year three, Abbey, but year zero, that's the cost of what capital, which we'll use later. MPV is still involved in this question. Present value is still involved in this question. So take note, and we have done all those things. Um, the company has determined the following discrete probabilities. We all know that probabilities is an occurrence, have it? it could be this or that, 
But we know that probability range is between zero and one. So here we could be seeing four point something like that. Um, yeah, one, there's cash flow. We are conversing with cash flow. And these ones are cash inflow, are they? The 14,000 is cash outflow. I hope you saw that. Cost of capital, they have not forgotten. And these are probability. This probability in normal mathematics is like frequency. I hope you understand frequency. Frequency is number of occurrence, are they? In what we call statistics. Or measure of location. And that of measure of dispersion. But there is variance here, which makes it measure of dispersion. But that probability is like frequency. So what you are doing mean is always X, which is the variable of it, cash flow times the frequency. Do not get mean. Here, we don't call it mean, but we'll, have, we'll put a symbol that looks like mean. This one is called expected value. Expected value. So the idea is here. Yeah? And when you are doing um, variance, standard deviation, we know there is a deviation of it, where we have the actual mean minus, uh, or the variables minus the actual mean. And we need to have some minus, some plus. So we'll get there. So yeah, one year, two year, three given. The treasury bill rate is currently 10 percent. I treasury bill rate is 20, uh, 10 percent, and the firm's cost of capital is 18 percent. Listen, that treasury bill rate is our cost of capital. That's what we call risk free cost of what capital. Don't forget. Treasury bill is risk-free. I hope you know, if you buy treasury bill, you are so confident. As far as the country is six, you will get your return. So treasury bill rates, if it's 10%, it's the same thing as risk-free rates. Are you following? And that is the uh, rates, which is 10%. And the cost of capital is what? 18%. And the question says, color currently borrows at the rate of 21% from the bankers. All these are just uh, statements that we can just speak about. But the one we are taking is the risk-free interest, which is what 10%. 18% is the cost of capital, uh, which in most cases we use as our word rate. But in this case, there is cost of capital. It borrows at what? If there was no cost of capital, would have used what? Risk free, which is the treasury. But they gave us cost. Sometimes they don't give you cost of capital. They'll just tell you the treasury bill rate is 10%. That is your risk free rate, which you will use. But now we are giving cost of what? Capital. We'll make use of what? Cost of capital. The guy is going at 21%. That is just uh, the kind of. Uh, you know, borrowing strategy or the amount of borrow. That's our problem with this analysis. We are asked to calculate A, one, expected value of net present value. Uh, standard deviation about the expected value. Coefficient of variance of the project. That's okay. So we're going to take it one by one. Year one, we find the expected value. Year two, Find expected value. Year three, find expected value. That expected value, and like I told you, is me. And that means we also find variance. Is that okay? Because we're going to find standard deviation. By now, you should know that the square root of variance is standard deviation. Have it? Okay. So let's see how far we can understand all these things. Um, solution to that question continues. The first one is uh, the year. Let me put it like this. Okay. The first one is the award one. So we are talking about cash flow, a bit. This is a cash flow for just year one, the loan. So we are handling that cash flow. Two thousand five for the first 
What matter is that you should do it very well and fast. What you practice some so far and so far. For instance, we are doing it now, and the exam comes, you see something like this. Uh, it's just to be fast and take sure everything in order. I follow the formula. Hello, sir. Uh, Hello, sir. Yes. I can, can hear you. Say, can we say this expected value is the expected value of the MPV? No. This is ordinary expected value. Okay. This is not expected value. This is ordinary. Expected value for year one. We'll get expected value for year two. We'll get expected value for year three. Before we look for expected value of net present value, which is Roman figure one. I mean, okay. is it clear? So this, this deviation, in case you don't know, deflation. Deviation, 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 and a tire. So, this deviation, that is called deviation. But those finance where people are this was for using mass to apply this. But for now, watch this is what we're doing. This is what we're doing. Minus. Yeah. Me. Are you following? No. This is A1. Now, look at your This is A1. Minus bar A1. I didn't listen. So, 4,002 minus. Minus. That was a minus. So, not bracket to. Minus what? Please, Rabbi. Next. Don't put bracket here. This one is not there. That's true. Where you know. Uh, this one is minus, who minus, let it be there. Oh, uh, yeah. This one is positive, okay? Yes. One, six, seven. So, next. Minus, okay? Yes. Minus one, next. Next. Yes. Three, one, and one. Abi? Is it difficult? Is there anything by me? I don't understand how you are arriving at the house. Hey, no, I'm just saying what we have done. Hello? So, please, I don't understand how you are arriving at this answer in the last column. Which one? Which one? The A1 minus. It's the last okay, look column. Look at the board. Look at the board if you are not looking at it. Before. This cash flow, Abi? Yes, sir. Then the cash flow, I gave it, I gave it a name, and then divide it as A1. I agree? Yes. Are you hearing me? I can hear you, sir. Very good. Now, if we got expected value, EV, which we call me, that is A bar 1. Is it clear? Yes, sir. Now, this next column or the last column on the board is what we call deviation, which means A1, this cash flow minus the expected values. And that's the result here. Is it clear? Okay, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you. Good. Now, the next thing is this. This is an A1 minus A power 1 multiplied by P1. Is it clear? You know, we have got in this and then what? Square. Because when there's a division, you have a division square. You remember? When we do division in normal probability, normal variation. When you have division, you have a division square. The boy was now with two pairs. Two pairs is nice. Probability. Is it clear? Don't forget the square. One way square is so the minus sign will go away. They will now multiply by the supposed. Frequency in normal mathematics that you are aware of. Can we? So, this is it. Hello, sir. I see it. This times what? This. Hello, sir. Times what? Sorry, sir. No, no, no. Square this. I will be a computer. I will be a computer. Square this. Multiply by this. 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 I can hear you. Sorry, I'm still I've still not gotten the column four. A one minus A um squared. And that's all about deviation. 
4,200 of A1 minus 6,630 of what? Uh, A bar 1. It was minus 2,430. Yes, please. Thank you. So now the next stage is that we are moving this deviation. We square the deviation multiplied by the probability so that we can get a variance of year one. That will help us to get standard deviation. In that room, I two. This one. Asset, <laughs> 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 Any questions? Both those online and those physically present, any questions? How far are you getting the best? No, no, I'm not getting that. Square this, multiply first one is one. Then the second one is what? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, 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 yes. four, four, seven, zero. Okay, yeah. four, one million. No, like this? No. Like no. this? No. Oh, what is it? One, 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 Okay, that's what it, I'll see if I have whether it's correct. I hope somebody will not say it. And uh, the thing is uh, not correct. Like, I noticed yesterday. Oh, yeah. The other one, come. One, six, seven, zero, raised to power two times. Oh. Three, four, one, five. 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 Six. 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 One six, like this, Abe. Three seventy square times four point two. Minus sign. Minus sign. I should put it. I don't know. I don't know. Minus sign. Minus. 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 We would have done like this. Minus 317, we put bracket square it, times. Square. I said it. So we put bracket square. Oh, yeah, the last one. How far? 27. 27. 3 0 Okay. Three yes. Yeah. 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 Is that a CD? Yeah. Yeah. That's two minutes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Um, we add all this together. This is simple for what? Variance. Sigma square. One of it. This is the best one. No, this is the best market. The best market you have is not in the finance world. You have questions. Every the person that is there, not even the person. We said that is it. I will bring back up. Hey, you were not around. Now. Hey, don't be angry. No, I'm not angry, but you're saying that you said because of it. The class has started. You came in. You find out what happened. Uh, you are now supporting the motion, which you shouldn't have supported. 
Let's move on. Don't do I I give you. Now you do because voila. You came late. You are still expecting us to move on. Let's move on. That's very rich. Summation of this is the add all this together. Let's have it. Add up, add up, add up. Two nine four one. Two nine four one. Two nine one six one hundred. That all? Yes. yes. Good. So we have uh, done your one. Oh, we just did your one. I don't go to the next year two, year three. Oh, we're not going to the reverse. Not to waste time. We we'll have to move on to year year two by writing. A, A to here, right? Here is a cash love. One. We have a B2 probability. And we have um, A2 times B2. We have uh, A2 minus uh, A bar. Two. What we have a two minus a bar two multiplied by a two. Okay, I have something like this. Ah, uh, yeah. That we, yes. Now, someone in the back that is not here. They just came, they put the phone of the phone out. Okay. No, no, I will just. No, no, I will go back and see what they are doing. No. Yeah, they just thought. They just see a video again. No, no, no. Go handle that. Yeah. Uh, the man of God is not that right. Yeah, that people show. Everybody wants to be clear. I think that we don't need to do the same as well. It's only so tense and so. We have seven five eight thousand and eight eight seven. O one zero point three five zero point two five and then zero point three. Now, if for instance, those of us who are just for me, if you miss the first part, that is year one. What I did in year one is what I want to repeat in year two. So if you understand you are two automatically, year one is just similar. So we'll take it together for those of us who are just coming for those who has not been part of us so long. Look at the board now. According to the question, we had year one, we had year two, and then also year three. What we are after here is to get the expected value. Expected value is the same thing as mean. EV means expected value. And uh, to get expected value, is that like we're looking for mean. On this board, the probability here is a frequency. <laughs> if we're doing normal you know, statistics that involve me. And uh, the cash flow here is our variable, which we normally write as X when you are doing uh, statistics. So, all we're going to do the first thing. Those of us on, online and those here, you can pay attention. For those who are just talking about what I will do, 4,600 times 0.1. Somebody help us. 460 times 8. 7,005. Look up. I don't know what I'm going to say. I don't know what I'm going to say. 
Seven times seven thousand five hundred times four point three five. Two six. What? Two six two five. Okay, two five. Two six two five. Two six two five. Two five. Good. Now the next one: eight thousand naira times four point five. Two thousand. Two thousand. Good. Uh, eight thousand eight hundred. And 0 0.3 two, six, two, six. I hope that is clear, everybody. For those of us just coming, and those who are here with us, any questions? I hope those first. Okay. Okay. Having done that, the next thing is to add this particular column together. That will be our expected value, which is equal to. Okay, let me see this expected value for your one, expected value for your two, which is A by two. And the result, I hope they have done that. This particular color, 460. 7725. 7725. Have it? Good. That's our expected value. And then I've forgotten that our deviation, this color is called deviation. It will be the cash flow. For instance, the first cash flow here is for six. So it will be 4,006 minus 7,725. So give us minus what? 3,125. 3,125. 3,125. 3,125. Okay. The next one, 7,500 minus 7,725. Two, two, five, minus two, two, five. Minus two, two, five. Two, 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 five. Okay. Eight thousand minus the expected value seven, seven, two, five. Two, seventy, five. Two, seventy, five. Good. Finally, eight thousand eight hundred minus seven, seven, two, five. What do you have? One thousand and seventy, five. One so remember, there's a square here. Don't forget that square. There's a square in the last column, which is a deviation square multiplied by the probability, the second probability. Any questions so far? Finally, on this year too, watch your, this is, this is the deviation column. Square it, square it, square it, multiply by the probability. Square this, multiply by probability. Square this, multiply by probability. And square this last one, multiply by the probability. By that is square, the minus sign is appears, the minus sign is minus, as always in plus, and it can change. So, what do we have? Minus 3, 1, 2, 5, raised to the power 2, multiply by the probability. For example, Nine seven six. Nine seven six. Five six two point five. Nine seven six. Five six two point five. Nine seven six. Five. Five six two. Five six two. Five. 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 Please take uh, that. Please take that again. Please take that again. The nine seven point seven five. So what we did? Uh, minus three one two five raised to power two times zero point one. They said it's nine seven six five six two point five. Is it okay, value? Okay. okay. I just press it on line. How far? Press your calculator, that's what you should get. Another one, minus 225, 
Square. One seven seven one eight. One seven seven one eight point seven seven five. Good. The next one two seven five square. One eight nine zero six point six point two five six point two five. Good. Finally, ten seven five square multiplied by one point three. Three four six six seven point one. If you look at what is on the board, it's not that simple. It's just following the nomenclature, obeying the rules, and your life will never be. Without wasting much of our time, add on this for us. This is a variance. That's a symbol of variance. Sigma. Uh, that's a symbol. Uh, square. Symbol. Mathematical symbol. Uh, this is that. Square. One three five nine. One three five nine. Eight seven seven. Have it. Eight seven seven. Okay. Eight seven. Good. So. We have succeeded in getting the first, getting the second, and even tell them to tell you to try the third. How about that? Is it okay for us? Are you tempted? I will tell you to try the third. Yeah, no, I've okay. tried the first, I've tried the second, out of three. Why not try the last one? Eh? Let's even see whether your answers are all the same. Okay. You are not even trying the first, second one. Yeah. See, that's good. I like this student. You are working hard. So please work as well that I cannot coordinate everything with, with Roman figure one, two, three. Those of us online, try and solve year three. Looking at the example of year one and two on the board, you can follow that same process and get year three. In case you have forgotten, your year three will be A3, B3, C3, and then like that. So try that one. I will go around and check and see where the answer for those of us physically here, those online, where they work.
It was uh, repeated in 2012-2013 section. And that was number 1B. That's a similar question that was uh, set. Yes. Was, uh, so which means you just need to walk. When questions are repeated like that, they come say no. It's likely examination. I hope we're done. We all agree, a certain value is six six. I is that everybody agree to that one? Yes. A spectral value six six minus zero. Yes. But a variance. Variance, I put two two million. So those are very different things. Please adjust. You get the same thing. Right. the same way. I'm not a those of us on right now, part which are your three, what was your expected value? We're on track. I love those of us online. Your expected value is what? 6690. Good. Your variance at year three is what? 21269. Oh, good. We are all doing well.
So we can now go ahead and solve. But now we're just we just want to start to answer question one, question two, Roman figure one, three. That's all we want to start now. <laughs> Remember what the person says. Um, the person says, Roman figure what? One. Roman figure one. Expected. Expected value of net present value is equal to um what's our cost of no what's our cost of project 14,000 14,000 when I say minus 14,000 I hope that minus is are you following? Let me pin. Don't worry. Let me find out. Yeah, zero. Uh, let me. This is zero again. Good. Plus, um, expected value for your one. Are you seeing it? Six, six, three zero over one plus ten. Why is it ten percent? Ten percent. No, first of all, that's ten percent for first of all. Let's use it. So you have one point eight. Okay, let's do this way. Let's do that. This Arabic. So I know that's Arabic. Raised to power one plus okay. seven seven two five over one plus R raised to power what? Then the third one you just got to that six nine zero over one plus R R raised to power three. Is it clear now? <laughs> no, sir, it's not clear. It's not clear. Okay. I look at the board. I don't know what that is. Oh. It plays present value. Wait, 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 wait. Let's put it this way. Hello, hello. Look at it this way. Our expected value for year one. You know it's a cash flow. Our expected value for year two, you know, it's also a cash flow. Our expected value for year three, you know, it's also a cash flow. Yeah. I had to redo that present value. Is it not a cash flow? Uh, are they discounted? Are they? Yeah. Second one, discounted. Third one, discounted. Minus what? CO. What is CO? Cash. Which is what? Is that the same thing as minus? Where's the bump? Anyone? I actually did this year. I don't understand. Which year? I don't understand. You don't need to look at it. This is I can start. I can start with this. That's discounted. This over this. Plus this over this. Plus this over this. Minus it. Let's do this. Whether I put minus first or I put minus and you are still not. The formula is this. MP is the best. Which is expected. A summation of CF I all over one plus R raised to power maybe. Let's say let's say yeah, let me use T. Let me use T. Then T starting from one to what? Minus what? CO up plus what? Minus what? This can start or that one ends. We're talking about uh, simple. Uh, it's not going to be much, my similarities. Hello, <laughs> sir. This, this is the formula. Are you following? So, this one I started from one, have I didn't start from zero. Because if I started from zero, I would have gotten this first. This is what I'll get first. That's why I say this. If I start with zero, it means I have to zero, have CO at times zero is our minus 14. And if I put zero, everything that will be one, I will now have minus 14,000. Then year two, put two here, uh, year one, put one here, 
who are here, who now get six what thirty over the R. Yeah, over one. That's the one. Then year two, who two here? That is CF seven seven two five CF two over this one with two that you two that seen on top. Who three here? Because the last one is three. The end is three. Who three here? That's the last three you seen. And the CF3, which is your estimated value at year one. Thank you, sir. That was a good No, we don't have to add so that everybody will understand what is happening first. Thank you, sir. Yes? Please, can't we just... I can hear you. Go ahead. Can't we just put this thing on the table, like the way we've been doing it before? So that uh, anyone okay. you like is a choice. <laughs> We have got in, in, in order to make it. Oh, we don't worry. We will we'll, 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 we'll take it that way. Don't worry. Let's do this one first. Put the sanity. Don't worry. So that uh, we have two options. Is it clear? The formula is not important. It's not about the exam. It's the second one. The formula is important. We all know MP. But if you still like the right formula, there's nothing wrong. Uh, but we'll just give you the formula that is it. Uh, let me see. Uh, so I'm going to try to. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Uh, let me put the word over. Alternatively, I can hear you. Yes. Okay, please. What is the CO minus CO? What is the CO stand? CO is a cost outlay, which is the as cost of the project. Minus uh, 14,000 a day. Okay, yes. Zero is cost outlay or cost of project, which is 14,000 in this question. If you don't like this first method on the board, you can as well arrange it. Zero, one, two, no, two. Uh, no, it's not. That's right. I'm not using this. Whatever you're right. So that someone will understand that it's still the same thing. This one is six. It's not important. Don't worry. This is the marker I'm using. I don't complain about my car. Is it okay? And in this yeah. case, she's got pop top at once. Then later, the choice So, whatsoever you get here is the expected value of the net present. Yeah, yeah. The choice. But this one does not take more space. That's why I mean. This one. <laughs> but anyone wait for you. Are you still like that one? Don't worry. The man told you to say that one. Oh, yeah, now. So it's okay. Anyone. But we are here to represent all interests as far as you need. 1.18. Have we? Agreed? Yeah. Our rate is 80% of it. Yeah. Yeah. So 1.2, we have to do that. Plus 7, 7, 2, 5, over 1.18, or is to part 2, plus 6, 6, 9, 0. Uh, is it clear now? So expected value of the net present value is equal to. Uh, the calculator can run everything for us. But yes, it's yes. <laughs> This is how to do it. You want to do like that. Watch. The time in your calculator 1.18 raised to power minus 1. Back to 6637. Oh, so 1.18 so so raised to power minus 1. So that you don't waste time examination. The calculator can do it. So 1.18 raised to power minus 1. Bracket to boom 6630. Close the bracket. Plus. 1.18 plus the power minus 2, bracket of 7725 plus 1.18 plus the power minus 3, bracket of 6690 minus 40,000. Please don't just touch without uh, wasting your time. Inverse is that. That will be S plus the power minus 10. One of the best. No, no, my that one is on nine minus one. First of all, 
Or you can read one one, no problem. You can read one one and do the best. Oh, yeah, somebody help us. Just do six six three seven divided by one point eighteen. If you get the answer, let us know. Does that right? It's possible. There's something wrong. Uh, this side too. Somebody help us this side. So I don't believe this side too. This one point zero, I mean, or just one. Um, one divided by one point eighteen. What do I have? Eight for seven five. Eight for seven five. Then divide this by one point eighteen. What do I have? Zero point seven one eight two. I mean. This one, divide this also by 1.8, 18. Six, zero. Good. Or I help us multiply this for 16,000. I'm giving you 16,000. 16,000. Your calculator, no. Maybe you don't need all those brackets. But I want to just do it the way you understand. Do this alone. Do this alone. Do this alone. If it's not working that way, I'm going to try with my own and see whether it's actually working. Uh, but somebody help us with this, this time, this is another option. I mean, this alternative will have been it. Minus 30, no, not that one. Minus 30,900. Minus 30. Did you subtract for this? What's the cost? Everyone, they have it. I know you add that. You add. You add. You add. You add. Because I don't know whether I want it should be subtracted, but I don't know how you do it. Whether you put it or minus or two. This was to be positive. The values here are positive. So for you to be having minus, that means you are being subtracted. So I got one. Because even if this is count, this. Oh, sorry. It's not possible because all these fans should be positive cash flow. Yeah, uh, that. Are you following? Yeah, we are. Good. So, which one are you calculating? You can see we have two methods now. Be two approaches. The first one on the right hand side of the board, and the second one a direct angle on the left hand side of the board. So, whichever the table is satisfied between one thousand two three nine. Which one? Okay. Okay. The final answer is one thousand two. One thousand. Based on the table, based on the table, anyway. Okay. Uh, oh, but yeah. is this the table or which one? Which one? Oh. This one is one thousand. Two three eight. Two three eight. Five. Five. Point three five. Five three five. Okay. Point three five. Is it like this? Yeah. You are positive, that me. What are you doing? Okay, okay, okay. Let's say, let's say three six and three six. Okay. That what you got? Oh yeah, let's come back and see whether we're going to get the same thing. Yeah, yeah. Somebody. Five six one nine. This is it. Yeah, this is the same. Five six one eight. Uh huh. Five six one nine. Five six one nine. Five six one nine. Cross check that, baby. Yes. Zero eight. Five five four eight. Five five four eight. Five five four eight. Uh, the last one. Four zero seven two. Four zero seven two. So, as estimated expected value of the NPV will be. Oh yeah, this minus. So this one, two, three, is nine. this minus. One two three nine. Is the same thing again? Are you saying it? You use this. To get this one. Use that one. To get this one. The choice is yours now. We have one shot. So choose the whichever one. That is the answer for Roman to the world. One of this question. We just got Roman to the one. How many hours? Two hours. Uh, you're not outside of the question, are you? I mean, I think there's one shot. They said three questions. At all. 
one from every section of it. And sometimes that section could be if the lecturer is taking you out to to three, there will be sessions. Or if it's only one person, two, you have section one. Or if it's one person, just the whole person and choose each other. There will be sections if uh, the number of lecturers is one. I will draw since we are everybody is happy with this question. Okay, let me know. I told you something to lose that way for it. It is that we can have a new one. Hello? Yeah. Easy now with finals and yes. work. I did everything. So and the work. Let me show you. Okay, now put the use. Yeah. This is what I want you to do. Go see what that. So what is for you? Uh, we have one, one, one. Let's do that. And this one is stressful. That's one important. I just ask. Are we there? Any question? You think? Where? This one. Uh, this one. This no, don't worry, don't worry. This can't pass just get it yeah. Our formula is this is this kind of part. Is that okay? yeah. Now, this is the one. Yeah. This is the one. I put the one. Who won? Don't get this. Put two. Put three. Don't get this. But we don't want to go through that process. This is the first one. Our, our value in the bracket is 1.1. Just divide this first. Our one point, you get the same. Okay. That is a Roman to go on. Can we clean the bar? Okay, I can clean this one. Is this good? Take off this. Take off this. Okay. Roman figure two. Roman figure. Roman figure two says standard what? Standard deviation. Okay. Standard deviation of the uh, expected value. Okay. Hmm. So, standard deviation, deviation, 
about is it about yes. uh, about expected by six or we know it's standard so our symbol our symbol is this because uh, we had variance have been square root of that so we'll not be equal to the square roots don't forget square root of summation of variance square starting from one to wherever it is there over one plus r <laughs> Starting from t equal to one, not zero, towards n. Don't forget that place two t, not t. It's two t. That's a formula. That's a formula. You must write this formula down so that you know what to do. For instance, <laughs> is it? Um, our first variance, year one, what? Year one? Nine, one, six, one, hundred. Let me, let me take it down a little. Right there on the space. And it says, what's it, two? Two, nine, one, six. Two, nine, one, six. One hundred. 100 over 1.18 or is to power 2 because 2 times 1 here 1 will be 2 you know this 1 plus r of it plus plus what's the other one 135 one three five nine eight seven five. One three five nine nine eight seven seven. Over one point nine is two of it. Yeah, two now. Plus the last one. Two one two six nine hundred. Two one two six nine hundred over one point one eight. Yeah, three, Abby. Six. Yeah, three. That's what. So, what's whatever we get is our what? Uh, standard award. So, I know I can't try to do it, Abby. Minus two times minus four times minus six. So, let's get it by the straight away. So, much. So, much. <laughs> Okay, they say they should give Those of us online, I hope you are following. I place this for us 1.18 raised to power minus 2 multiplied by 291600 like that plus. Oh. 
million. How much? I got three million. Three million. Five eight three. Five eight three. Five seven six. Five seven six one. Eight five. Eight five. Eight, five. I have find the square roots. If that's correct. One eight nine. One nine three point zero three. One eight nine point. One eight nine three point zero three. Three. Yes. How much? How much you contact? So I will know where. On the same page. So that pass online. I hope you have calculated. Have they tried? One point eight of one point eighteen for those who are not getting it. One point eighteen raised to the power of minus uh, two. Correct, I mean, so that means that the number is first class. So we are doing well. So that's the answer for Roman figure two. For Roman figure three, which is the final part of the question. Roman figure three says we should find for every cent of it. For every cent. For every cent of what? Variation of the project. Of the project. Variation of the project. Variation of the variance of the project. So in a simple language, this is also known as standard deviation of the project. Yes. That is standard deviation. So, variation uh, of the variance of the project. Is the standard standard deviation of the project over expected expected value of the project or expected value of Next present. There's no shot. Next present. Yes. That's the formula. Progress. Value of the project. value of the Already, I've got the Already, I've got the Similar question. That's how to do it. So, our MP we have it. So, that means this up. This up will be up, have it? Yeah. 1893. This divided by this, have it? The first. Okay. okay, the last over the first. Roman figure two. 1.5. Over Roman figure one. What do you have? 5.8. 4. 1.5. Are you sure? This one is up, are you? Yes. That one is up. 1.528. 1. 1.528. 1. 1. That's okay. Standard division is 1.8. 
So what's the result? It says what? One point? One point five to nine. That's the answer. Covariance. Covariance. CB. Covariance of the project. One point five. What does it mean? Two. Sorry, Anytime we talk about variance, variance is all about risk. That's very variance. So when it's too high, we should not invest. When it's low, it means that the risk involved is more minimal. Okay, the percentage now, for instance, now, if we're having a percentage, and this amount is going to give us how many to see 1.5 to 10. 1.5 to 10. I'm going to have it like uh, 30 points now. It looks uh, high. If the percentage is 25, 24 points, something like It's fair compared to this, right? But 1 point something is good for us to invest in service. Mm -hmm. What was what when when does this um, current um color was it currently goes and what was the same thing? How much was any amount of dollars project? Maybe we have uh discussed together to but there is nothing there's nothing boring in this question we saw. Uh, Question of better has is to check the riskiness of this. At what point do we use this 10%? So, no, this 10% is uh, risk free. Assuming there was no cost of that. If there's cost of that, so this point is borrowed. It's not even like a borrowed, it's relevant to that he borrows. How much he borrows? Nobody told us. But we know that whenever the guy this money, he borrows. <laughs> Any questions? <laughs>
Any questions? We have refuted mathematics of finance. We have also done something on capital projects. That's a vision of I've done it before. We're just trying to remind some of us that have uh, concluded that the exam will be general. So just to remind you of what you have been doing as well to us. Just keep on practicing. There's a no serious problem there. While some of us are looking, there's a question I sent online yesterday. Yesterday's uh, okay, yesterday Friday I was here. There's a question online. Okay? No, I we did it. Yes. Uh, you, you were around, Abi. No. But you have the question. But one time it was. I will. I will the question. I know they say the network the was so. Let's just. I'm not solving. Though, just to explain. Now. Now. Okay. I don't want to analyze the question. Analyze the question that you know what happened. And it's your copy of it. So, why was there annual profit for all the first You ask questions where they pay you. Because I checked on that question. There was no addition of the annual profit. That's true. Now, now look at it. Just to throw more light on that, because I know network was there. Uh, so, let me just throw more light on that. According to the question, it was all about cash flow, have it? We were not giving cash flow. They want us to get what? Cash flow. And what we did at that point was that there was a production of detergent. There was units of production. Year one, there was unit of what? Production. Year two, year three, year four, I believe year five. Yes. They gave us units. And the person said, selling price per unit. Selling what price per unit was given as 14 era if I can recall it. 14 era. We now use the 14 era to multiply year one, 2 million units. I remember I got 80, 80 million. There was 3 million. I multiply by 40, I got 120. Like that, year one, five. That column saw the total world sales. Is that what I said to yes. Good. The question continued. There was a variable cost or variable expenses. Sometimes they could give us variable, yes, they could give us variable cost by unit. But this person did not do so. If we were given variable well, well. cost by unit, I would have used the variable cost to multiply those units for me to get the total variable world cost. But the question says variable cost should be 52% of the sales. That means year one we multiply by 50% to give us variable costs for year one, for year two, for year three to year five. That was how we got the column of variable world costs. And uh, there was a fixed expense a week, which is something as fixed cost. And that fixed cost was 1.6 million. Am I correct? So we put that 1.6 million throughout year one, year two, year three, year four, year four because it's fixed. It can't change. It's like rent, have it? Good. We have seen total sales. We have seen total variable costs. We calculated things world costs. In that question, they wanted to start the business. They have to incur costs, have it? They bought machinery. For them, probably, it could be a construction company that needed some equipment to start the business. They bought machinery for 25 million, have it? Am I correct? Yeah. And it was yesterday, I did it, I can still collect. 25 million. And that asset, which is motor vehicle, no, machinery, yeah. was to last five years, Abby. 
Last bank. The silver value was 520,000. We said you should remove the last zero because the receiver value cannot be more than the original cost of the assets. In case you have forgotten, receiver value is what is left after the user of the assets. And that is what you can sell the asset. And that receiver value is an income, not an expense. Yes, sir. Because when you have used the assets, use everything, even food, you have used food. I mean, finish everything that is on top. Do not give it up for an amount. Is it not a profit? Is it a loss? It's a profit. So residual value is a profit. And remember, residual value is always at the end of the period. For instance, motor vehicle has residual value. Four years was the last part of it. At the fourth year, that's how we put down residual value for motor vehicle that will be added to sales because I need to Year five. We feel the silver value for machinery and equipment. Yeah, fine. I hope the team is getting, they're getting those who have written something. No, some that wrote something that yes. But even if you have not written something that, if you have the question with you, all this my explanation should make a little sense, even if it's normal for little. Now, are you following? No, what have I said? I've done it. We have looked at sales, I mean, we have looked at variable costs, we have looked at fixed costs. Is that okay? Now we are going to depreciation. Right. For depreciation, we all know there's what we call method of calculating depreciation. This one is a straight line method. That method says C minus estimated risk value, whichever one, all over N. That's how to calculate what? Depreciation. Each. Machinery and equipment. We'll put the family here. Oh, 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 18. Oh, 18, I mean. 18 million minus 20,000. All over what? Five. We got the value, either three million something. Three million something. Abby? Yes. Good. That for machinery and equipment. Please, what question is this, sir? We also did photo. Four million. Four million. Four million. Four million. Four million. Four million. Minus one eighty thousand, Abby. All over four. Because it's four years. We got the value. You will agree with me that there's all called accumulated depreciation, Abby. There was depreciation for motor vehicle. There was depreciation for machinery. All joined together. So give us depreciation in year one, depreciation in year two, depreciation in year three, depreciation in year four. We have to stop at four because my motor vehicle does not get to five. So on that fifth one, it's only machinery depreciation that was there. Is it okay? All we are doing is just to get cash flow. According to the question, we now discover that there is a Badagri pack. There was Badagri pack that was operating before. And that Badagri pack was making a profit of one million. Right? And they said by the second year, that Badagri business should be closer. The green self in the second, is that the grammar? Oh, is it in the, in the second year? Which is the second year? Is it say after second year? Is it say before first year? Please, where is this question? I will travel to America in this year. Does it mean next year? Now, English language, you got this year never end, have you? Have you seen what that the December? All of them are this year. So, if I said that the business will be shut down in this year, in the second yeah, so there was that means after making the profit in that second year, they'll do what close it. So, year one profit one million, year two profit one million. That means in year one, we're going to add our profit to sales of year one before we take it away. Before we subtract variable costs, subtract fiscals, subtract depreciation of year one, 
for us to get cash flow of year one. We'll do the same thing in year two. Annual profit in year one will be added to sales in year two. We'll now subtract variable cost of year two, fixed cost of which is fixed expenses of year two, and depreciation of year two for us to get cash flow. Year three, there is nothing there, only sales. Minus variable costs, minus fixed costs, minus uh, depreciation to give us cash flow. The last part, year four, residual value for year four, which is motor bear probably, will be added to sales of year four. They now subtract variable costs, subtract fixed costs, subtract depreciation for us to arrive at the cash flow. Year five, there was also reduced uh, residual value for machinery. You add it to the sales of year five, then subtract variable costs, subtract fixed costs, subtract depreciation to arrive at the cash flow. Remember, you now have cash flow of year one, year two, year three, year four. You now put it that same way with the other time. You now write year one, zero, one, two, three, four, five. Our year zero. The machinery cost was 80 million, right? Photo vehicle cost was 4 million. Working capital, which is the cost of running the business, which is also a cost, is uh, 3 million, right? Is it 3 million? Working capital, 3 million, right? Mm -hmm. Abi, so we now added the three million to four million to eighteen million. It gave us twenty-five million as minus twenty-five million, which is our cost of what project. Then you join it with the cash flow, year one to five, and you start doing what you know how to do best by calculating paper. Already we know cash flow. Then we have no cash flow to get net present value. Is there a problem? Everyone who does it in their present value now. Eh? Uh, IRA. That was what we are doing. We're not told that if we continue, we won't go. That we can use modified internal rate of return and we can get it and we got the result. That made us take two decisions that the project should be worth accepting. Any question from what we did yesterday and today? So that uh, we can see how far we can go. Any question? Sir. Yes, sir. a moment. Yes, it's part is in the address book session. It's in other case with that you bought. Is there? It's part of it. All I say is that if they say she use I tell part, please use. Please use. But if they say use modify entire of the please. I what would you do that is that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I told you to continue. We we'll tried 90. You can try 200%. You can try 400%. You know, the values are not meant. It's just for you to try. But as well, try 90 is not working. Go ahead and try 200%. Because all we have to is MPV to be negative so that we can solve I. It's okay. Continue until you arrive at negative. But I'm not telling that instead of using that one for the purpose of the plan, that we can also get the answer with a modified internal return. So, this is how you We use it now. Well, when we did MP, I will go first. The present value of the MP we added that represents our future value or the terminal value. Then, why the cost? Represent the present value. I remember that interest rate formula R equal to the N root of F B over N P V minus Y. What's that? Could you work, sir? I did. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Under our present value, Abi, future value of money, we derive the formula from there. And this is it. 
That S is the number of the cash flow plus five. Yes, you got it. So put five here. Future value. All our present value that we have got, add them together. Then the plus zero is the present value. Yes, that's what we spend as cost. Then after finding the square root of all these n roots, minus one over, it gives us the modified interest rate. When the interest rate is higher than the cost of capital, oil is less. Well, you know, we are giving cost of capital less than 20%. And now we've got 49 and then about the percent So that value is higher. So we are set with it because it's going to give us a better return. Any other question? Okay. Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, we'll stop there. Mighty cannot help us. So we ignore it. I keep on trying. But I'm saying try to help. Okay, we should keep on trying. Keep on okay, I couldn't try because I have to do work. Okay, you are there with the hey, Yes. Everybody is for what? Is it modified in banner rate of return? Modified one that's for this one. That is what is I use that right? bit to analyze it. But when they say you use IRR, you should continue. Because the person was given to every book. So I should see my continue here to 200 percent and see whether the MPD will be negative. negative. If it's not negative, you continue until it's negative. But let's assume you're in a exam hall. Let's assume you're yeah, in a exam hall. Yeah, yeah. You're yeah, in a exam hall. You try the team. No, you go to the next question. What question can I pass you? <laughs> because if you stay there and they say stop, I say, no question, I say you should continue. <laughs> okay. Uh, yes, one moment. <laughs> Hey, this is Arab. So I'm looking at which part of the you know that in every organization there must be somebody that will mind the finance and accounts. Am I correct? I don't need you to pass. I don't think. I don't think any company does that. They can employ another person, but not accounting or finance as a part. No. But our money will be saved. I don't know what I mean. Such person has like the whole thing. You know, there's another report of profit. Yes, that's true. That cash is profit. They use that profit. Maybe for five years or more. To analyze. So they make it this way. You know what's a catastrophe? Yes. You know the accounting ratio is used in accounting to analyze what I it's just protection. In a world from a normal, I told you, it's a good action sometimes. It does analyze. So that you can guide them. That does not mean you will also not do no more precaution or how to manage the resources. It's just analysis, which can help you. And you add your own job to make sure you do you should leave